In this video, we will discuss point file formats. Point file formats control how columns in a point file will be mapped when importing the file into the drawing. They are located in the settings tab, in the point category, and here we have point file formats. Let's go ahead and look at an existing point file format. Note to create a new one, you can simply right click on here and click on new. Let's look at the standard PNAZD comma delimited. We'll go ahead and double click it. This will open up at the point file format column. First off, you can change the actual default extension. So for instance, if you're using a lot of CSV files instead of TXT files, you can change that as well. You can also do coordinate zone transformation, which will basically transform the coordinates to the current files coordinate system if you have one defined. To change any of the columns, simply click on the column header. And of course, you have the standard different column names that you can map to your point file, depending on what you have for a point file format. If you'd like to actually load in a file, you can click on the load option here and navigate to a point file and then click parse and it'll actually bring them in and it'll tell you what's happening with each of the columns here. You have some additional options available as far as what's delimited by, read no more than, and sample every specific set of points based upon the value defined in here.